Martha, what do you want to know about her? <laughs> You're crazy. Come here. Come here. She's pretty well known locally. Uh, she is a character. Uh, a, a lot of towns, they have a uh, town drunk or something like that, and we have Martha. Want to see how my ninja kick? No, not no. really. Hey, ducky. Hi. Remember me? Look how beautiful they are. She doesn't seem to have an understanding of property or ownership. She just kind of does whatever Martha does. Martha? Uh, she's she's a she's a local customer. Just getting the essentials. Uh, right. So. She just sort of comes in and out of your life, seemingly unpredictably. Hey, I know you. I know you. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So you got you got to come here a lot, huh? Mm-hmm. That's cool. Yeah. Me too. I saw the ducks, uh, two of them. Uh, they were <laughs> they were making love. Two of them. One was on top of the other, he was biting the back of the other one's neck. The male one is, he wants to feel dominant, right? So he, uh, yeah. All right, well, good seeing you. I'm gonna go feed the ducks. Yep, okay. Um, it's pretty good right now. We're, we're getting a lot of customers recently. Like, it's really, it's not like... Martha, get out of the road! She's always doing this, man. So I'm just saying, like, I'm doing pretty good around town. Dude, dude, is that Martha? Dude, that's Martha. How does she get around? She's all over the place. Dude, I just really don't know how she just, she just shows up places. Like, hey, different. boys! Ah! Ah! What, what are you doing here? You can't just walk into people's cars, Martha. Sure I can. We should go see the new Walter Mitty movie. I heard that was good. I Don't almost had a heart attack, Martha. You can't just show up. She still sends me farm farm bill requests. Like who does that anymore? She added me on Facebook, and I should never have accepted. She messages me every six hours. It's clockwork, and it's always like an invite to do Jello shots or something absolutely ridiculous. I don't know how she even gets access to a computer. She doesn't have a home. And she got banned from the library after she tried to barter her collection of shoes to pay the late fees off. I don't understand it. Funny story, actually. She came in uh, a, a couple days ago. She tried to rob the register. And while she was doing that, the cops showed up. And they found a snickerdoodle in her ass. Ma Martha, what are you- No, Martha! Don't jump in the water! Ma no, Martha! Stop, you're not supposed to- Ma Ah! So, I know I'm enabling her, but I kind of feel like I have to protect her like I'm her guardian. I mean, I was the one to take her to get her stomach pumped after she ate a sock. Other than me, I'm pretty sure she only has, like, her drug dealer. She has a pretty serious drug problem, but, well, the community was concerned at first. Parents were worried about the influence on, like, what it would have on their kids, but even eight-year-olds think smoking styrofoam is a bit ridiculous. I've been, uh, I've been doing styrofoam since, uh, I think, sixth grade or something like that. So of course, I was 15 at the time. It took me a while to finish sixth grade. Hey, you. You back there, geek. Can I borrow your lighter? Thank you. <laughs> the trick is to hold the styrofoam in. 
uh, uh, brings out the effects of the hallucinogenics of it a little better. It gives you a crazy, wicked high. I mean, you can't get arrested <laughs> for smoking styrofoam. That's just nonsense. So that's why I do it, just for freedom. I, um, I like to, there's a lot of ant hills in my neighborhood, so I like to look at them. Sometimes I like to feed the ants orange soda. Would you excuse me for one second? Yeah, so I stopped injecting it just because of for health reasons. Oh uh, no. Okay. Hey, I'm all out. I'm all out. Oh no, 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 no. This can't be happening to me, not today. <laughs> ah! No! Styrofoam for a couple days, so I'm getting kind of anxious. Come back here, relieves stress sometimes. So, a lot of people say she's a compulsive liar, but the thing is, I really think Martha totally believes in everything she tells you when she says it. Sudoku, huh? Um, I like that game. I'm not very good at it. You, you know, know what I am good at? P frisbee. Look, it's called P frisbee. P frisbee. Yeah, it's where you uh, you get a frisbee and you urinate in it, mm -hmm. right? And then you freeze it over. Like you can put it outside if you live in a cold area, or you, just in a freezer, or whatever. But then the next day, overnight, you crack it open, and, and then your pee is frozen into a disc. And then you can throw it at your friends, throw it at animals, cars, anything really. You ever played that? I can't say that I have, Martha. Hey there! Oh my. Hey! Martha, what are you, are you doing? doing? I don't know. Martha, I'm in. I'm in, in the. Yeah? I see that. You ever accidentally reach for the toilet paper, but you grab the duct tape? So you then you wipe with the duct tape, and then you're like, what? What a predicament I have myself in. Whoa, wow, look what we have here. Martha! I'm busy. Can you just, like, leave me alone for once? I just. Hey, do what you're doing. I'm not doing anything. I'm not gonna bother you. You're not watching any pornography, are you? <laughs> no. no. Have you ever uh, you just been bored at your house, so you get a you get a earring and you put it like you you stab it through your nose and you pretend like you're a Native American fire dancer. You ever uh, been out of toilet paper, so you have to sort of improvise? So you grab the baby wipes and it's like. Like, ah, I don't like that. It feels too wet on my on my butthole. What are you playing? Let's see. Magic? You know, my, uh, I actually know some magic. Do you? Yeah. I dated a guy in college. He actually taught me some. You know, I had the, the trick where uh, the magician, he has a top hat and he makes a bunny. He, he pulls out a bunny. Well, imagine that, but my boyfriend did it with my ass. Great, <laughs> yeah. You ever, uh, you ever roll around in a field of cow manure and pretended you were Arnold Schwarzenegger in the movie Predator? Um, no, I haven't, Martha. I haven't. What? Surely I can't be the only one who's done that. You ever stuck one of these things? You uh, pretended that your that your private parts is one of the wall sockets, and you go whoops, and you plug it in. One time my phone actually did charge. I put this in my in my hoo-ha and I swear I'm not lying, it my phone charged. Do you have a phone? I don't. Well my my uh my alarm clock did charge though. I'm not even joking. You have an alarm clock. Did you see someone's alarm clock? Can I play? You wanna Let's get some cards from Martha. Where are you? Let's get some cards from Martha. Where are you in the game? Can you 
please get out of my house? Come on, let me play. Just one, please. Martha, another time. We're, we just told you that. Come on. She's a sweet lady, and I kind of feel bad for her, but it just comes to a point where you got to say enough is enough, and I think I'm going to have to cut her out of my life somehow. You like looking at the fishes? Beautiful fish. Um, yeah, yes yeah. they are. My mother took me here all the time. I always fell in that pond though. I fell in so much that the city actually told me to stay away from this bridge. Oh. But I do it anyway, cause... You ever fallen in? Um... No, no. You never? No. Come on! You know those black, uh... Uh... Little sticky things? Like, they suck the blood like a vampire? Leeches? Leeches! That's it, yeah. Yeah, they'd always like suck out the blood from my areolas. That sounds bad. Oh yeah, it was, it was awful. Uh, Can you imagine? Like, try to try to imagine just bleach is sucking the blood <laughs> blood out of your areolas. I I don't think you should come around here anymore, Martha. Why? Because I don't really know you or how you found me or how you come keep on. getting on my property. Well, I mean, your gate's always open. I just think it's like a party going on. That's not normal, some drugs. Martha. What? Oh. I just really need some Xanax. I, I don't like to be the bad guy, but I don't think you're bad at all. You're a good guy. That's that's very nice, yeah. but I I need to assert my my I need to stand my ground here and say yeah. that uh, you 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 shouldn't come around here a, anymore. All right. I'll leave you to. Just word of advice, don't fall in the pond. Well, you have a good day. Good. Bye. Uh, so I, I guess I'm just gonna have to hitchhike my way back to Vegas. Somehow. Become a showgirl again. I mean, if I did it once, I can do it again, right? It's just hard. <laughs>